Judy Garland in blackface, a photo of the actress from 1938 is trending from a controversial role she played. Though it was 83 years ago, fans of Garland were shocked to see the photo of the actress in blackface from the movie Everybody Sing a year before she graced the screen as Dorothy in The Wizard of Oz at 16 years old. One tweet reads, two movies, a year apart, same b Shout out to Gen Z for teaching me this. Twitter has since added reader suggested contacts to the tweet, quote, Judy Garland was a minor who had no agency over her decisions and was under a highly abusive management. As an adult in the 1960s, she became a very vocal supporter of the civil rights movement. Garland also wore blackface at least once more in 1939's Babes in Arms, along with a close friend and co-star Mickey Rooney. Some fans have come to her defense saying, quote, there is a viral tweet going around that shows Judy Garland in blackface next to a still of her in The Wizard of Oz. And it's like, what is this supposed to prove? Someone posted, quote, she was a drugged up, abused child actor who later became a civil rights advocate. This info isn't hard to find. Another tweet reads, quote, the Judy Garland discourse today is insane. Did she apologize for doing blackface? Babe, she's been dead for 54 years. Like, get a Ouija board. I don't know what to tell you. It is known that Garland struggled for much of her life with drug and alcohol addiction when studio executives demanded she take barbiturates and amphetamines as a teenager to stay thin and energetic while filming. Before she died of a drug overdose in 1969, Garland was an avid supporter of the civil rights movement, where she helped organize and fundraise for the 1963 March on Washington.